In this video we are making a cute little kitty. The link to the pattern is in the video description. The materials are listed here but you can also have another look at it in the PDF file. We pin and sew all pattern pieces together. We start by putting two body pieces right sides together each and sewing along the center front and back seams. We then put two arm pieces right sides together each and sew all the way around leaving a hole on the back edge as indicated on the pattern piece. Then we put the back and front head pieces right sides together each and sew along the front and back center seams. We also put both tail pieces right sides together and sew all the way around leaving the short bottom edge open. We then put one grey and one pink ear piece right sides together each and sew the right and left top seam leaving the bottom edge open. Now we clip the corners and turn the ear pieces inside out. We also fold the ear over as shown on the pattern piece and stitch the fabric into place. We cut off the extra fabric. Then we pin and sew the ears to the marked ear position as indicated on the pattern piece. We now tack the ears into place with a few stitches. Next we can pin the back head piece to the front and sew all the way around leaving the bottom open. We turn the fabric inside out. Now we can pin the front and back body pieces right sides together and sew all the way around leaving a hole open at the top.
We clip the curves, shorten the seam allowance and turn the fabric inside out. We turn all the remaining pieces inside out as well, clipping corners and curves and trimming the seam allowance where needed. Next we can stuff the head, the body, the tail and the arms. Then we can close or tighten the holes at the bottom of the head and at the top of the body. Now we can sew the head to the top of the body, the neck. Next we are closing the openings in the back of the arms as well.
Then we can sew the arms to the sides of the body. I'm using a ladder stitch here as well. Now we are closing the opening at the end of the tail and sew it to the lower back of the kitty. Next I use a pencil to draw on a face. You can make the eyes, nose and mouth as big or small as you'd like. I'm using dark grey embroidery floss to stitch on the eyes, mouth and nose.
Now we can draw some wax crayon onto a piece of fabric and carefully brush the cheeks by rubbing the piece of fabric onto the cheeks in a circular motion. I'm using Melissa and Deb crayons. Next we sew the oval patch to the belly using a whip stitch. I also added a little bow. A tutorial on how to make a bow like this yourself is linked in the video description below. And then the kitty is done. My daughter thinks it looks like a bear. <laughs> if you like, share a picture of your project in the Sammy Facebook group. The link is in the video description. Thank you so much for watching and for sewing with me. Please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe for more videos if you like, and follow me on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter. I'd love to see you over there. See you next time. Bye!